So, we started off with the sugar push. Yeah, we talked about adding a four bead extension. One, two, we're going to put in triple, triple, then continue three and four, five and six. We did the way old school. You walk her in, you do the favor shuffle to the side. Three and four, five and six. We did the salsa ish, Latin -y version where you walk her in, send her back. Then hit three and four. By the way, that's a really cool move, guys. To take into something like a tuck. Nice little pattern all by itself, yeah. Mm -hmm. Then the final one that we did was turning or alternating triples. Triple step, triple step. Send her out three and four to finish five and six. Just so you know, you can bring it along the left side. Triple, then send it out three and four to finish five and six, yeah. We took a basic pattern, a reverse whip, taking the hand over the follower's head, picking up the upper arm, actually closer to the elbow, giving her a single turn to go ahead and finish out. We then took the same pattern we talked about giving the follower room as needed. By letting go of the hand, she can then embellish it however she wants. A little bit more modern look, same pattern. We then talked about putting the alternating triples in the front of the pattern. This is the equivalent of count two. Flip it right over for three and four, finish the move five, six, seven, and eight. Yeah? We then talked about doing alternating triples that spin or keep the follower progressing down the slot. Three and four, I'm going to stay in front of Sam, turn her around. This is now the equivalent of count number two. It's absolutely imperative I stay in front of her. You guys wanted to let her get past you. Make it a free spin from there, and then go ahead and finish. So we ended up with. <sighs> Alternating triples in the front, hit three and four, alternating triple in the back, and give her the spin. Yeah? As an added bonus, for those of you with the camera. <laughs> when you take the alternating triples in the back, when you flip it over, there's nothing wrong with flipping the hand, changing to the other hand to make the spin happen. You want to go into the big leagues, flip it over, and do it behind your back. Whoa. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Now it's a big time pattern. Cool? Thank you.